My name is Insane Raven. We are back with Infamous Second Son. Welcome to a brand new trophy hunt. And what are you doing? Look at the arrows. And I'm joined with Stina Chan. How you doing, Stina? I'm so very proud of you. She's so very proud of us, guys. Um, I remember how we said it was gonna take us four more videos in the last video to uh complete it. I lied. This is going to be the last trophy hunt for a while because then we're going to go right into the story time with Infamous Second Son. So that means this is going to be a three in one trophy hunt. Woo! Are you ready for this? Alright, that's fine. So right now we are looking for audio logs. And I have a feeling I have to go up. Just, just a feeling. Oh, okay. That got us really close. Nope. Going for the way. Bye-bye. Oh, wait. Nope, nope. don't find the way. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. No, that's right. I think it's inside. Can it? Can it? Wait. I'm surprised you didn't know that the DUP was... Yay! Trophy! Trophy! That was really fast! And Lojack's back! Shut up. Ha! <laughs> strong, easy to train, and versatile. I have a feeling we were supposed to be listening to that. And then I took a dump, and I couldn't believe what came out. Anything that's what he was trying to do? Nothing important. I don't know, like, I have a feeling... Unless a snake came out. I imagine. All of the plant and organic abilities made people uneasy. Wire proved way too hard to control. Paper didn't convey strength and security. Surprisingly, glass was a strong contender, but eventually proved too difficult to master. Augustine's concrete ability more and more became the only obvious choice. She was the poster child of the DUP. It made sense her ability would be the one imbued in all the troops. So, um, that text is quite interesting. I don't know, you probably heard that as accurately as we did. But, um... The only reason why those are important is because it gives the entire backstory of the game. It tells you, clear cut, this is how we got here. This is how we did it. This is how we did it, did it, this is how we did it. So now where is this one? And jump over the bowl. And I jump can't over jump bowl. over things. Mm. There it is. Salutations. What did you just say? Godspeed. Oh, I thought you said that. <laughs> touch me like you do. Touch, touch, touch me like, like you, you do. do. Oh, yes. There it is. The crazier this city gets, the more it just proves Augustine was right. So we're proving Augustine's right. Yay! Yeah. humans can't. Too different. Too dangerous. I mean, think about it from this. Powers to if humans have a bad day, they might punch a hole in the wall or crash their car. Conduits have a bad day and the body count is in double digits. Conduits are in a completely different weight class than humans. I'm not like Augustine, they don't have some. It really does. For how all this should play out. But I do know I don't want to live out my golden years terrifying my neighbors or worse. Okay, so Augustine um, wasn't so much uh, chosen immediately, they had more of a trial and error. Raiding rate. You leave. Does that mean I have to stop that? Is this gonna mess up the trophy? It might mess up the trophy. Why would the game give me a notification about it? Because they want you to kill it as soon as possible. Alright, so I'm gonna go deal with that. Alright, you guys ready for a raid? 
Are you ready to rumble? And take us completely away from the trophy we're going to get. Next game. Get your power. So Augustine was then immediately be like, yo, I want to be it. It was more of um, a trial and error thing. And she was just the best for the job. Which is quite interesting. Um, the story, the story, the campaign, um, is actually a very different story than that, according to Augustine. So that's quite interesting. Mm -hmm. So that's that's gonna be Guardian Angel. See, if I was invisible, I'd just get into trouble. <laughs> like, the people who knew I could be invisible would be like, Dude, it's just... It's Raven. Jungle ice cream skull. Raven! Ah, oh, the humanity! No, it's just Raven, guy. I kind of have a feeling if like God ever got really pissed and got into a street fight, this would be his move. Summon my angels! <sighs> Everyone dies. <sighs> you know? Yeah. <laughs> I only got two people. Oh. You guys didn't see that, right? They're all giving up. I'm gonna just do all you guys so I don't get to you guys on call. And then we can go back to our trophy. You rude, rude people. You see, these are the only two I have in this area. And then we have the other half of the other. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Slowly. And, um, with these final two trophies, we can start our story time. And I'll find a way to drop everything. Mm -hmm. Hello, train. What if he fought and gave him an extra little boost? Ha! Ha! Imagine that. Ha! Who's that? He just fought it. It's just his. Super Toots! You watch that? I love. It was a correct. Like Billy's story of when he was. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's not right. <laughs> so now I'm going the right way. Probably on the ground. He looks so happy. Did you see that? He was just like, hand in the air. Woo! <laughs> Oh, 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 Next one! I have no idea how those two dumb junkies managed to stay one step ahead of us for so long. And Fetch had her worst day ever. She killed her brother with her powers. It was Where's an accident. Wait, hold on. When we found her, she was a wreck. The easiest collection my team's ever had. I put a lot of people in Curtain K before that night. I, I never thought.
thought much about what I was sending him. Now, now it's all I think about. Ah! I don't know what that girl needed, but it wasn't a prison. You never played the story, right? Uh-uh. Okay, so I don't know, you guys probably heard that, but I need to explain why I'm freaking out now. Um, he was talking about Fletcher. She's one of the, uh conduits that you meet and becomes like your best friend yeah. and she's why you get all the neon pretty powers yeah. so again very interesting he's telling a very different story than Fletcher did oh you got another one yep let's do this wait nope mm. down oh it's down here <laughs> music random music Random music is random. Indeed. Fetch Walker spent the better part of a year in Curtin K in the corner of her cell curled up in the fetal position. She might be a badass laser beam thrown conduit now, but back then. No drugs to keep back the demons. A loud voice is more intimidating than her. So now that she's talking about um That was all part of Augustine's plan. Break her down, train her. Break her down again. It was sad as hell. When I saw Fetch's escape on the news feed, I had to fight to keep from smiling. Okay, so that's interesting. Okay, the way this guy explains the story, I'm just gotta say, Insane Raven, you sound exactly like him. Do I? Do I have that voice? Yeah. Wait, where am I going? I was hoping I could fast I don't understand fast travel yet. <laughs> so you know what? I'm just gonna teleport people. Yeah. Yes, just fly through people. Because in this game, you can. You can, so why not? Why not? It's crazy. It's a perfectly normal thing to do. Absolutely. Of course. Just fly through people. So now that we're over here. I believe I can fly. Whoosh. I got so much. Wait! What? Nah. I was gonna try to do the drop everything trophy, ah. but the way I was gonna land was gonna land me straight in water, and I wasn't gonna be able to do it. Oh, sad Raven is sad. <laughs> they are not shooting at me. Whoa, yeah, let's not go in water. How do conduits live? Because I was thinking about this. The weakness is water. How do they live? Um. I was over there. Why are you going that way? Is it this way? It's in that general area. Yeah, it's in the yellow. I don't pay attention to the numbers. The numbers, Mason! The what do noise. they mean? The noise. The white noise. There was this girl at Curtin K, Celia. Apparently, Augustine had brought her in before they're even. No, we haven't met Celia. Character. She was our first prisoner. She'd been kept in this prison for so long, she didn't remember what it was like on the inside. That's great, babe. When she learned she was going to be transported to a different facility, she didn't take it well. Curtin K had been her whole life. She couldn't handle the thought of leaving. You can believe that. The day before transport. She killed herself using her own ability. It was the saddest, most unnatural thing I'd ever seen. When Augustine saw the body, she just stood there. No emotion. And she told me and another guard to clean it up and get ready for the transport. 
Please. No. Uh, uh, scared people. I want that trophy. Monkey climbing. Augustine was when she realized you've been drawing power out of those core relays. She had no idea. Out of the core relays? That's cool. It's also very small. <laughs> Anyone can do that. She immediately ordered a recall of all including track codes. Music? Thank you for being dramatic, but I can't hear. Uh -huh. she stormed out of the command. I'm ignoring that. Nope. Wait. Yes. Beautiful. Don't know Just more pissed. There is one more. I want that trophy. Just try to use. Let's just do this. Top one of the buildings. From the building. Nope. What? That was cool. Moon walking. Woo -woo. I got that by the chat. <laughs> Last one, guys. This is it. One last one. Kind of feeling nostalgic over here. Is that weird? Find out what the mission was. Ta-da! 
different conduits there. Let's yeah. make everything spreading. Here in Seattle. Glass, wire, paper. Spreading party! Spreading party! What can happen if you came to Kirk? Spreading party! I'm so dizzy! Oh, you guys get sick. So dizzy! I better terrify Augustine. For those of you who don't want to throw up anymore, I mean, who are still here not throwing up, is that right? Is that right? Thank you for joining us on this trophy hunt. My name has been Insane Raven. This has been Steena Chan. This has been an infamous Second Son trophy hunt. Next time we're coming with this game is gonna be a story time. Woo! See you guys in the next video. I'm uh, excited to see that.